all know the Isle of Man TT, but soon the south of the United Kingdom will be getting its own thrilling island road racing festival, complete with spectacular backdrop, with a major new motorsport event to be held on the beautiful Isle of Wight. Named the Diamond Races, a reference to its Diamond Isle moniker, the event will comprise a 12.4 mile long circuit to the south of the island, including a particularly fast 5 mile stretch set along the military road coastline. While the event draws evident parallels with the iconic Isle of Man TT, the Diamond Races will have the distinction of bringing international road racing to the south of the United Kingdom and be dated for the autumn after the 2021 British Superbike Championship finale. By launching a major motorsport event on the island, it is hoped the Diamond Races will showcase Isle of Wight's natural beauty and encourage spectators to make the journey with a location just two hours from London. Complementing the Isle of Wight Music Festival in June and Cow's Week in August, the Diamond Race is set to become one of the highest profile events to ever take place on the Isle of Wight. By penciling in an autumn date directly after the BSB finale, which normally takes place in October, the Diamond Race is being billed as an end of season motorsport celebration. Indeed, it's hoped the event will attract a full bevy of international road racing stars and become a key date on a UK motorsport schedule with key names involved in its creation including TT winner Steve Plater, ex-Honda racing manager Neil Tuxworth, and Isle of Man TT clerk of the course, Gary Thompson. The new race meeting will be run under the strict event regulations as stipulated by the sports governing body, the ACU, through which all UK motorcycle sports is administered. With road safety at the heart of the diamond races, the organisers will strive to highlight the paramount importance of safe road use, with meticulous attention paid to the safety of the riders, spectators and officials, while incorporating a strategy to promote road safety. Speaking at the launch, Paul Sandford, CEO and co-founder of the diamond races said, the Diamond Races is the culmination of years of hard work, dedication and planning by the whole team and we're lucky to have the best of the best involved with its setup. No stones being left unturned in striving to deliver a spectacular event, which we have every reason to believe will be a regular backstop to the island's tourist season and put the Isle of Wight on the international motorcycle road racing map. <laughs>